Is that your sister? Is that your sister, baby? No. Is that your sister? Are you happy? What's her name? Bule. Yeah, Bule. Yeah, Rocket gonna look after her? Yeah. Okay. Is Rocket gonna be nice to her? Make sure Rocket doesn't jump on her, okay? If Rocket jump on her, you suss a Rocket, okay? No, you don't suss a Rocket. Hey, leave Rocket alone. Oh, wow. Uh. No. Cheers, baby. Cheers. Yeah. Cheers. You know. Mm. Yeah. <laughs> Four, come here. On the 21st of May, our daughter Fiapule went into hospital to have an operation to remove two small one centimeter sized lumps or also known as polyps that were discovered in her cervix and were taken away for tests. On Tuesday the 25th of May, we were told the test had come back with signs of cancer. As shocked and heartbroken as we were, the doctors and specialists wanted to move fast and get down to the bottom of it and confirm that it was 100% cancer and also what steps were needed to be taken. By the end of the week, Bule had completed an MRI and an MIBG scan. The results showed the cancer had already spread all over her body and even inside her bones. Bule was finally diagnosed with stage 4 high-risk neuroplastoma children's cancer. This vlog is for our families and friends that are supporting us from afar. Big or small, 
We appreciate you all as we go through this journey together. Thanks and much love. All right, so we are on the way um, to the hospital. Hello. Say hi. You ready? Yep, this is the day where um, Pule gets her central line um, put in um, in preparation for chemo. So, very nervous. Um, I think we've had a roller coaster of emotions, um, but at the same time, you know, we're very hopeful and we're trusting. Romans 8 28 that God is in control. Through this all, um, we know that we'll get through it. We've got to say, Pule. Yeah, she's square eyes. Let's pull it. Okay, it's gonna give it a nice hug, okay? Yeah, for my lossy. Pull it, my lossy. Best to put her pants, best to put on her pants. It's okay. It's okay, wow, cool. This is special cool. just for you. It's there for you, baby. Just for you, baby. Tell it, pull it. Doing so, I'll try and get in touch with someone from Oncology to come and speak with you. Yeah. Um, in the meantime, please do keep her fasted now. Yeah. Um, I okay. Go. Hello. Savali. Still trying to kill time. Kill time for Vipule. Yeah, baby. Oh, careful. Hey. Careful. Hey. Hey. Slide. No foil alo. Yeah. Slide. Slide. Oh. Oh. Push, 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 push. Push, 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 push. Yay! So I'm just about to go in and Bully is going to be getting her um, chemo shot. Your life is going to be different after this. We've been waiting four hours. Yep. Okay. So four, four hours. Um, this one hasn't. Oh, actually, it's from seven a.m. till this is about four o'clock. Um, she's been fasting, so she's a little champion walking around saying, "Hey, hey, what's up, Chippy?" But she's done well. Hey, Pule. Yeah. You're doing well. High five, Pule. High five. I want chip. I want chip. <laughs> Eat yeah, you can eat, yeah, okay. yeah. Mm -hmm. You can eat your chippies after, baby. You got this. You got this. You got this. Malosi. 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 Yeah. Malosi. 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 Pulley loves lights. That's why she has lights everywhere. Even on her shoes. Yeah. Say bye. Bye. Say bye here. Yeah. Say bye. Say bye. Say love you. Forever. And ever. So yep, food time. Thanks to Alex for the for shouting. And uh, I'm just gonna give, Ranch is gonna give an update of where we're at today. Uh, what time is it, babe? At 4 o'clock. 4 o'clock. just went in for her operation. And uh, 
and she's gonna give a, an update of where we're at and what we're doing. Yes, so um, she's just gone in for, they put her to sleep, they said it'll be about an hour and a half, so they're gonna do a biopsy on um, the tumour that's on her back, and then they're gonna do, um, take a sample of uh, her bone marrow from her hip, and they're also gonna be um, putting in the uh, central line. Um, all of it's non-invasive, so she's not having, you know, they're not cutting her open to have the surgery, but um, yeah. It, it's, um, I think this is the third time that she's been put to sleep, so um, it was definitely, yeah, I don't know if it gets easier, but I, I got Sila to hold her this time, because the last time I didn't have big enough muscles to hold her down, um, but she went to sleep a lot quicker um, than the last time. I think it was good that we shared with the, um, the people that do the anesthetics that the last time, you know, it was pretty traumatic for her, and um, the guy was just able to hold the mask on and she went to sleep a lot faster, so... So it's nice, it's nice um, poor thing had to fast from 7am to 4 o'clock and by the sounds of it, um, because she's staying overnight, um, she, they try and push them, you know, to the later appointment, um, they could have told us that earlier, so words of advice, if you, if, if you ever come to the hospital and you have to be admitted and, and you're waiting on like a surgery or anaesthetic, they're most likely pushing you to the end of the day, so just be prepared for a longer fast time. Yeah, cheers. Yo, okay, my turn. Yeah, so yeah, Maran just explained everything that yeah. um, we've just done with Pule, like she's just gone down with anesthetic. Uh, I got my sunnies on because I'm um, yeah, hiding my my crying eyes. <laughs> so I had to hold Pule down and stuff. And um, yeah, she's she's pretty strong for a one year old. Um, so she went down pretty fast um, compared to the last time. Um, yeah. Uh, she's going through, yeah, she's having all those little surgeries and stuff. Um, so it was good to speak to the specialist and the sur surgeon. Uh, and he gave us, um, you know, just comfort knowing that we're not going to, you know, make, cut her up or, you know, cut her open and have little scars everywhere and stuff. So it's all sort of, uh, I think with the technology nowadays, it helps and stuff. So I'm pretty happy about that. But i um, still... Um, high on emotions and stuff just because when you see your little one uh, especially your one-year-old um, you know that they shouldn't be going through that kind of stuff at this age and stuff but unfortunately um, our fear pool is and um, <coughs> yeah we're just going to stay positive she's going to have a feed uh, she's going to be um, her operation is going to be about an hour and a half to two hours so we're just having a I'm having a ham and cheese avocado panini and what are you having I'm having lots. I'm having all of that. Yeah, That's so, all for me. And stuff. So this is our lunch. Um, yes. So we haven't eaten too. We've been fasting more fully. Because <laughs> it's not like we can eat in front of it. <laughs> and stuff. So it goes. Um, so yeah. But the journey starts now pretty much with the operation. Like um, yeah. So uh, still taking everything in. Still trying to stay positive. Staying. Still relying on. God's peace and, and trusting in, uh, that uh, Paul is in good hands. Uh, yeah, so I'm just gonna have this feed and then probably go up to uh, the ward where she's gonna be uh, recovering uh, in the next hour or so. So yeah, we'll um, yeah we'll see you guys soon. Yo. Um, for CPE, like, or
Yeah. She almost ran. Does go through this as a as a young family that uh, yeah they could uh, sort of see our experience and and maybe it can help them to stay positive uh, with their hopes um, that um, they're gonna get through it. Uh, we're definitely staying positive for our bully, um, our family around, um, and here in Sydney, also in um, Samoa, New Zealand. Uh, extend the family around Australia that are all praying for our little girl to um, get through this. Yeah, we're just grateful and thankful for everyone's supportive prayers, kind words, uh, words of encouragement, words of uh, uplifting. Uh, yeah, it's, it's, you do have your little tough days. Today it was pretty tough because it was. Um, uh, it was her, you know, her first day of operation, so um, first of many, uh, yeah, first of many, so yeah, I'm just going to hit the road now, find what just my cars on, and yeah, we'll see you, see you guys soon, um, see you again, sweet, thank you. Oh,